New details in the search for a missing child at the center of an Amber Alert. His mom is now in police custody and the little boy is safe. Law enforcement in several Florida counties was searching for the mom who's accused of taking the child at gunpoint. The land police officers say they found the mom and two-year-old. New 6's Lauren Korn is following the new developments. She joins us live outside the DeLand Police Department. Lauren. Yes, Lisa, the mother is being held here right now. This after U.S. Marshals found her and her child uh, just a few hours ago at an apartment complex nearby. And right now we're hearing that Orlando police officer is on his way over here to interview her at the police department. U.S. Marshals executed a search warrant at the Enclave at Pine Oaks Apartments today where they found and arrested 33-year-old Suhei Perez-Diaz. Here's a picture of her sitting down outside one of the apartments. Authorities say they also found her son there, 2-year-old Genzel Cintron Perez, who is in good health. However, it's still unclear who lives at the apartment complex or how they tracked her down. Multiple agencies across Central Florida spent hours searching for Diaz, her son, and another woman who was with them, including the Ormond Beach Police Department. Police say a customer noticed a suspicious woman with a child at the Ormond Beach Walmart around 1 this morning, but didn't call law enforcement until 5 a.m. once she saw the Amber Alert. Since then, officers searched hotels, shopping centers, and parking lots for the trio until they learned they were found. Diaz is charged with armed burglary and aggravated assault. Uh, there's no word on if the other person who was with them, that woman, if she's been arrested at this time. Lisa? Lauren Korn reporting live for us in DeLand. Thank you. New 6's Lauren Cervantes is also following the new details in this. She joins us live outside the Orlando Police Department with more on how this all started. Lauren. Lisa, yes, that's right. A two-year-old is safe and with DCF, and they are working to reunite that child right now with his family. Now, the child's mother is in jail after she took the child from his father's home at gunpoint. Two-year-old Genzel Perez was found in DeLand in good health. The child's mother, Suhei Perez-Diaz, was arrested under the warrant for armed burglary and aggravated assault and is in the Volusia County Jail. Just before midnight last night, Diaz, along with another person, kicked in the door of the father's house, where the stepmom was asleep, and abducted Genzel. I was in my house sleeping with my two babies um, when this crazy woman went into my house, kicked the door, and took uh, baby Genzel from me. She told me if I move, she would kill me. An Amber Alert was issued and multiple law enforcement agencies worked to locate Genzel. She did have another individual with her. We're still working to identify that person positively. Um, they were armed with a firearm. Law enforcement put out a vehicle description and were able to locate them. In terms of who has custody of Genzel, the Orlando Police Department says there is no custody agreement from the court in place at this time. DCF was involved and what had been negotiated between the parents was a voluntary custody order whereby the father was in custody of the child. But stepmom Stephanie Maldonado calls Diaz an unsuitable mother. She had a, a visit with DCF on Monday and she was really drugged. She, she doesn't care about the child at all. The child's mother, Diaz, was last arrested in December of 2018 for carrying a concealed firearm. In Orlando, I'm Lauren Cervantes getting results News 6. Lauren, thank you. We will continue to follow this developing story and post updates at clickorlando.com.